what's going on YouTube, it is Wallet of Fourth here. Today I'll be showing you guys how to set up the Elgato Game Capture. So here we are. We have the Elgato Game Capture, which is pretty small. It is actually <coughs> smaller than <coughs> sorry about that guys. I have a cold, but yeah. And it's in the summer, so it's weird saying a cold. But anyways, that does not matter. What does matter is the Elgato Game Capture. And today I'll be showing you guys how to set it up. So this is the Elgato Game Capture. It is smaller than my Samsung Galaxy S3. That's what I'm recording with. And for what you guys need, this is for the Xbox 360. That's what we are going to be setting up. And so what you need is two HDMI cords. Like that's an H two an HDMI cord like that. That's the one they provided me. And then an HDMI cord like that. And that's the one that I already have. And then they also provide you this other one. Um, this is a USB cord that plugs into your computer. And then this one plugs into the Elgato Game Capture. So we're going to be setting this up. So let's head over to the Xbox. And the so here's my laptop. Here's my Xbox. Here's my TV. But okay, so I'm going to set this right here in between the Xbox and the P PC. Let me exit out of this. Okay, I was watching some videos. Okay, so what we're going to set up first is the HDMI cable to your Xbox 360. So what you do is you take this cord and put it into the HDMI in. So right in there. Just set that up real quick. Okay, it's hard recording and doing this at the same time. Okay, there we go. I'll set up. Now we're going to fit the other end of the HDMI in to the Xbox 360, which is right in here. Okay. Got that set in. Okay, so now that we have that in, all we need to do next is take the H HDMI cord, and this is the HDMI cord out. So we put it right in the HDMI out spot. You're sending the HDMI cord. Find the end of this. It's right here. Okay. So now we're going to put it in our TV, which is right up there. So, put it in. This might take two hands. It's a little. Okay, there we go. So now, let me change the inputs to what just happened. So now I'm plug something. Okay. HDMI. What? Okay, I have no idea what's going on here. Does not want to try just plugged in all the way? I always make sure it's plugged in tight. So let me unplug that real quick. Sorry about this, guys. It's taking a little too long. Just point that out the room. Okay, now that we've got that plugged in, should be working alright. Got everything plugged in. Now let's try that again. Okay, there we go. It's finally working. So now that we have it hooked up to the TV, it takes a while to load, but it says no signal. Signal. We're just going to turn on the Xbox 360, and it should turn on. So next, we're going to take this cord the USB to micro USB cord and we are gonna s take this micro USB and put it in the USB slot right there so let me just put that in real quick and I'll show you guys what it's like okay that's what it'll look like the HDMI cord right there and the, the USB cord right there take the end of the USB cord and put it into your laptop or your computer Okay, now that we have that set up, so what you have is the HDMI in going into your Xbox 360, and you have the HDMI out going into your TV right up there, and then you have your your micro USB cord going into your laptop. Here, this is what you can get this game 
recording system on GameCapture.com. Here's what my Xbox looks like. And then it's, I have a little bit of delay on mine. Let's go to live. And what's going on on my Xbox is what's going on on my PC. So you can start recording anytime and go right up to edit. So once you edit your videos, you can just uh, edit them. Or once you capture your videos, you can go right to editing. And it's all good. So, guys, I hope you liked the Xbox tutorial version of the Odato game capture. <clears throat> I do have a PS3. I don't know if I'll upload a PS3 version. I don't know yet. But, yeah. So, that is all. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.